I'm here tonight. The Lord just picked me out of the Hamilton family down in Watford, Mississippi. And I came, moved, we moved to Olive Branch, and the Lord saved me. Uh, I, I was just about 15, 16 years old, and my parents wasn't saved. My mother was a snuff dipper. My daddy was a good deacon in the other church. I don't guess I call that church name. Uh huh. And, and But he was a good daddy, but he just didn't have about one or two girlfriends. And uh, uh, about my daddy now. And uh, he go to church, he moan sometimes. Uncle, he had a few of them, others about a couple older brothers. I said to the Lord as a young boy about 15 years old, I said, Lord, it got to be a better life for me. I said, it's got to be a better life. Got to be a better life. And that's all I know. But one day we were passing a little like St. Luke church out there, and I was a big, beautiful church out there, Pastor Earl Shannon. A little church then. I said to my father, I said, let me out here. And why is he going to the church? He even had a lady friend with him, but we couldn't say nothing, you know. Uh-huh. And mother went with him. He's at home. And uh, let me off here. And I got by there. I saw y'all having church. But I, I, I picked my Holy Ghost out. And I said, now, Lord, I don't want to be jumping. I don't want to be dancing. I just want my Holy Ghost to stay kind of cool and kind of handsome, you know. Uh -huh. I don't want to be falling in the floor. I don't want to be slopping. I saw y'all slopping. And, and they used to call y'all Holy Rose. Hey, brother. Uh, yeah. uh, uh, and, and see, they, 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 they had tails out on y'all on Sundays about four years ago. Mm -hmm. they, they, they said they, they'd fallen out and they'd thrown them sheets over and they said they were ro rolling with one another husband and wife. Now, you know, if that had been true, we'd have been, our children would have been large and playboy. Hello, son. Playboy wouldn't have nothing on us if they were doing that. But they know they weren't doing that. But they were falling out, but they weren't falling out with men and women, not together. But anyway, I stopped by there. I'm going on. I stopped by there and I said, Lord, I want to be saved. And I stopped by there and then they, they told me I had to give up. Because back in that day, they said you couldn't court and couldn't have no sex relationship with girls. And that young wouldn't have it anyway. And they said you can't start that kind of stuff. But I said, I want to be saved. I said, I want that Holy Ghost. Put us on the altar and they called me, told me to call Jesus. And once they give up and all that kind of need to do all that too. Give up, call Jesus and everything was going on. And, and one night, I, I was down there, and one night I made my mind up as a young man. I said, Lord, I, I looked over there in that church, and I saw an old time over there. Great head. He said, they say he'd been there for many years. He yet did not have the Holy Ghost. And I said, now, Lord, I'm not going to sit in this church and look like him without the Holy Ghost. Either I'm going to receive the Holy Ghost, I'm going to get back out. And that old head, that's over 50 some years ago. I said, Lord, I'm not getting back out. I'm going to be baptized with the Holy Ghost. And on, on, on night like tonight, a Wednesday night, is this Wednesday night? You shout and tell somebody, this Holy Ghost night. Yeah. Oh. Uh -huh. Take it easy now. Take it easy now. On a Wednesday night, he baptized me. While the preacher was preaching, I broke up the preaching. So I was speaking in tongues. Hello here. And then um, I started wiggling and moving. I already told all I didn't want to shout and go on. But you know, it was a package deal. When I got the Holy Ghost, my feet got the move. And I got the fire. Oh, yeah, I said, wait a minute. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. I don't have long. And uh, it was a package deal. But well, Lane, it was a package deal. And, 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 and that's my nephew. He looked just like I looked back then. Show him sure what I did. They can't do it long. Can't do it long. Can't do it long. That, that's it. Hold it right there. Go. Y'all said that guy. I, I came home that Wednesday night. And uh, Told some of the others, to my sister, my sister was with me. Then my father, I'm ashamed to tell my father, I thought he didn't care. Somebody else told him on the, on the work that they said, they called me Robert Lee. Robert Lee received the Holy Ghost. And he came home that evening, he said to me, you didn't need to tell me about the Holy Ghost. I didn't thought he cared whether I got it or not. But I said, I, I got it, but I can't explain it. Yeah, hey, yeah. I got to go now. But I tell you, back then, Mother Porter, it was work 
and in the bed. And my brother and I, we slept together, four of us in the room, two in each bed. I know y'all don't do that now. Hello, and I got in bed that night. Uh, my brother, he's a pastor in Mississippi now. I got in bed that night, I shook the bed. And I didn't tell him I had the Holy Ghost. But when I shook that bed tonight, he said, Robert Lee, you got the Holy Ghost. One of the days I want it. So I laid it down on the Lord to say, I'm going 